Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Jenny Day. Welcome back if you're not new. Today I'm going to be doing a What's in My Bag Speedy B edition. I did film a What's in My Bag for my Alma BB, which I will link up here so you guys can check it out. But today we're going to do my Speedy B. I have been wearing this for about, how long has it been? Two or three weeks now. And I don't see myself changing out of this anytime soon unless I do end up traveling. Even then I feel like I will still bring this bag with me because I just love it so much. It's so functional. It carries everything that I need it to carry. So without further ado, let's go ahead and see what's in my bag Okay, so I'm sorry if the audio changed a little bit or if it got a little bit louder But this is my speedy B. It's a speedy bandolier in dummy a bean and I do have charms on it So I'll go ahead and show you guys the charms first. So let me zoom in a little bit So this is my luggage tag that I got gifted to me from an essay And then this is my palm that I got from zoomies. You guys can get these on Etsy Amazon. Yeah, I I like this palm, but I just don't feel like the hardware is that great. So I will probably switch this out for one that I find online that might be a little bit of better quality. But I do like the spiky look of the of the palm, which is why I leave it on. And I still think it's really cute. It does match with this little black macaroon that's on my lottery charm. So yeah, I'll go ahead and zoom you guys in so you can see that. But look at how cute this is. I got this from the Grove and I just did my nails yesterday, so aren't they so cute? But anyway, um, so yeah, I do have a, what is it, a brown bow on here, and then you have the Eiffel Tower, the macaroons, and then it just says lottery. I'm not going to show my phone because I do usually have it in here, and obviously it does fit in here. So when you look at it, this is kind of an overview. It's a little bit messy at the moment, but we'll go ahead and get right into it. The first thing I have in here is this little notebook here. I keep um, information on expenses, um, my budgeting, and what I can spend my money on, how much is going into my savings this month. Um, so yeah, just things like that. I also keep like a list of things that I have to do on a certain day in here and like just different things that are usually in my planner, but I also need them with me at all times. So I don't carry my planner with me all the time just because it is really big, but I do like carrying this little notebook. So I just kind of write down um, like a duplicate of what's in my planner and I know it seems like you know not efficient enough but when I write things down I usually get them done faster so yeah that's uh, my little notebook and I don't know the brand of this I got this in like a in a kit with um, from Target it came with like three so next in my bag this is my um, cosmetic pouch this is in the Damia e. Bean PM I believe and if you guys want to see what's in here we'll go ahead and push that back a little bit so in here, you can see I have quite a few things. I have a scrunchie here. I have my um, powder for every day. And I just use it like this because this is the most efficient way for me to apply it to my under eyes. And I like using this one because it's super, super full coverage and it does exactly what I need it to do. Sometimes my under eyes will start to crease a little bit and I will need a little bit more coverage because when I do drink, it does get a little bit darker on my under eyes. So I like bringing this with me just to kind of touch that up. Next, I have some tampons depending on, you know, your flow. I have regular and... Um, light. I don't know why people are so embarrassed to call these tampons. They are what they are, tampons. Then I have some Advil here. I have the 200 milligram. I get headaches pretty often, so I like bringing that with me. And then I'm not going to take out all of the cough drops, but you guys can see that in there. I have an altar receipt for a return that I have to do. I have a pen. I have um, my favorite lip gloss. This is in Hot Toddy by Buxom. And then I also have my L'Occitane hand cream. And I have a tiny one. I do have a one that's a little bit bigger than this, but for right now, this one is fine. And then I have a compact mirror. This is just an Anastasia mirror. So yeah, I have like a magnified version and then I have just a regular mirror. So yeah, I love it. Super compact and cute. And then I also have some uh, Dayquil cold medicine just because I was sick. So let me go ahead and put all of that back in so you guys can see. And then I'm actually going to put this in first because it was bulging a little bit. And then it's in there. And that was all. So when you zip it up, it doesn't distort the shape of the canvas or anything. It's just perfect. Next, I have a pair of sunglasses. These are sunglasses that I wear every single day if not my Chanel ones. These are by Barton Piera and I really like them. I don't know why I have two sunglass cleaners, but I do. But yeah, I love these. And I don't like the case though. It's a little bit cheap, as you can see. Um, it's kind of wearing off. 
so let's see next okay these fell so i'll show you these i have wet ones and hand refreshing wipes because sometimes wet ones um these do have alcohol in them so you don't want alcohol in your hands if you're gonna go back in and eat some chips or eat a fruit or something and you want to lick your fingers this is a lot better these kind of smell like baby wipes but um, they feel really nice to just remove any sticky residue or if your hands are a little bit dirty from makeup before you um, left the house and you forgot to wash your hands, you can just use these and I really like them. Next I have my mini pochette here and this is from the Holiday 2018 edition. Um, the only thing that I don't like about this is, I don't know if you will be able to see it, but you can see that the um, hot stamping on the L and the M is a little bit faded so that kind of sucks but um i did uh talk to an essay at louis vuitton and she did tell me that you can just go in and they can take it in for a pair so that's pretty good um but yeah i love it mini pochette alma and a trunk in here i have a lip balm i have some eye drops which are really necessary i have hand sanitizer here this is just a bath and body works eucalyptus I have my purse ring holder, you guys can check my Alma video for a picture of how I use that. A pack of gum which I haven't opened which is a shocker because I chew gum all the time but I guess I've just been brushing my teeth um, a lot more often like I brush them maybe three times, three or four times throughout the day. Some hair ties and then last but not least my Chloe perfume. This is just a travel size. And then I do have one little dark mark in there which doesn't really bother me as much. Um, and then you can see my, my little tab there. So putting everything back in, exactly how I took it out. Not much disorting there. It's super cute. So then my cat just decided to like, sit behind there. Then I have another hair tie. Um, and then I have my phone charger here. This is usually in my cosmetic pouch or my Chanel mini O case, but I don't know why it's out like this. I think I was using it yesterday. So yeah, phone charger. I do want to get a shorter one because I feel like that's just too long. This is my external charger when I'm out f um, for the day and I know I won't be coming back home like within let's say four to five hours. I bring this with me all the time just because it charges my phone about six times. You can see this is fully charged. But yeah, it charges my phone six times. It charges it super fast as well. And um, if I need to do a voiceover or if I just need my phone for maps or something, um, this definitely comes in clutch. Next I have some Kleenex. I have um, my AirPods here. I do have a case for them. I'll leave a case um, linked down below with several different colors if you guys are interested. And then I have my GlossierBalm.com lip balm. This is really good. Then I have my Key Clay. Oh, by the way, my cat scratched me. Um, and this is in Dami E. Bean. I've had this for years. I literally don't know how long I've had this, but I do want to get a six ring key holder or a four ring key holder because look at how like worn this is. These are actually like pretty similar colors. Yeah, these are, this is the same color as this. But this has faded a bit. You can see the print is starting to lift off. The corners are so, so like worn. The zipper is completely worn. Everything. I stuff this so much. So I have my gym membership card and then I have um, keys there. And then I have my wallet. This is from an All Saints wallet, but it's just like a little pouch. And here I have receipts, I have some cash, um, I have my uh, debit card, credit card, and an ID in there. I have more receipts. And then you can see there's a separator here. So I do have coins in there for parking meters in case my boyfriend runs out of coins in his car. But yeah, I love this so much. Um, it's not really organized, but it's like the perfect size. I do want to get a Victorine wallet, so hopefully I can get that within the new year. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all that's in my bag. And then um, in here, let's see. I took out my textile cards. Um, I do have them stacked together based on um, which purse it is and stuff. And I do have them in like a separate little compartment, but I don't keep the textile cards in my purse anymore just because I feel like um, I'll lose them where they'll get messed up and faded and so on and so forth. So in here, oh, I have some cash. I didn't know that. Wow. $101. <laughs> okay, that's random. Uh, so let's go ahead and just put that in my wallet. 
yeah so didn't know that was in there and then I don't have my keys in here just because I do have them um, separate and I also have my Alma keys separate so yeah that is everything that is in my bag I will have this palm link down below as well as this keychain if you guys are interested um, thank you so much for watching but yeah this is what my bag looks like also someone asked me if it was made in France and yes it is as long as it's made in France or the US I'm okay I don't like pieces from Spain because they have a lot of like faulty issues with them which I've experienced and then I also only have two straps on them because I like it better as a shoulder bag um, as opposed to like being a crossbody I feel like it's a little bit uh, I don't know I just don't like wearing crossbodies so yeah I also took this strap and put it on my Alma and it's so cute sorry Looney sorry uh, it accidentally hit my cat but yeah I love this bag it fits so much um, I can show you guys um, how I will go ahead and just put everything back in here so let's go ahead and do that so first I'm gonna put these in here and I'm gonna lift up this tab actually and then ouch 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 that hurts and then put them in and then put this right over that just because um, I don't reach for those too often um, unless like I'm you know in a really uncomfortable spot or place and then I'll go ahead and put my wallet there um, mini pochette in there like so and then oh I actually forgot about my little book I'll put this right behind my wallet it is a little hard to get in and out of but it's okay it doesn't bother me at all actually and I don't use an organizer because this bag is pretty structured let's go ahead and put the cosmetic case inside Louie, she's trying to eat my charms. So that's what it looks like right now. And then we're gonna go ahead and put this right on the side. I'm gonna take this and put this right on the side as well as these items here. And then take my sunglasses, put it right on top. These items will go over just right on top, like so. And then let's go ahead and zip up. Let's go ahead and zip up the bag. Stop, Looney, stop. So yeah, so this is what it looks like. There's not too much of a sag to it. Honestly, um, it's actually really structured and I love that about the 25. So yeah, if you guys have any questions about my bag, let me know down below in the comments. But yeah, I think this is super cute. Um, I don't really care that the hardware is kind of like wearing a little bit because these are so cheap that I can just get another one. Um, I think they were like $5.75. <laughs> so yeah, um, that's basically it for this video. I don't really want to get up and show my face again. So um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe down below right to here so you guys can... Um, you know, not miss another video, but yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Say bye, Looney. Say goodbye! <laughs>